All right, welcome everyone, Resemblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we're here for Link Click, Season, season one, 1, Episode 2. two. And we've got ourselves a time, a time travel, travel story. Time travel and story. it's kind of a time-like heisty story in a mm -hmm. well, as well, because we're not just hijacking someone's mind uh -huh. and stealing away a little bit of their precious time, yep. but we're also, also yoinking info and uh things that are required and maybe kind of like on a bounty hunter kind of situation yep. just for basic survival which i mean there is a little bit of that potential like vigilante justice kind of thing potentially going could on be. here could be but mm -hmm. these two have a gig yep. and it's going it's and going so far it's paying. so far it's yeah. It's just their equilibrium. They don't they don't they don't have any like this is our first time doing this. It's the nope. no, we've been doing this. Yep. We've been Let's doing clock it just in fine. again, you know. We've got like a thousand times we've had Cheng drilling the like, yep, yep, these are the rules. Don't yeah, yeah, fuck no, with the rules. I, yep, go with I, it. I won't fuck it up, Lu Guang. Yeah, yeah don't yeah. worry. No, well, but much. he fucked it up. Yeah. And although maybe not much after all, because maybe maybe we'll things see. ended exactly the way they were supposed to. I, I love that this is your, your your like you are the one that's harping on a theory like uh -huh. immediately out oh, the gate. Yeah. Like oh, yeah. it's fun being on just, the other side of things. Right I just now. love the idea of time travelers for hire. Mm -hmm. That just sounds so fun, and at the same time, like such a disaster. Well, right, but that's the thing. We don't know that they're advertising themselves as time travelers. Yeah, they might not be. Yep. In mm -hmm. fact, I'd say there, there, there's no there's no way they're doing that. But if there are, can you imagine what kind no of society way. that would have to be where people could do that? I mean, yeah, we yeah. that's the thing. Yeah. This show decided to give us just the mm -hmm. few rooms that they were in their 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 business, yep. actually. We have a better perspective on the past than we do on the present. And that is true. So yeah. episode two, let's show the present. Mm -hmm. And y'all, without further ado, let's get into it. <laughs> 从没想过有一天他会背叛我，另立山头。所以他才这么着急。I love how it, we went from like corporate, you know, fuckery to well, smaller scale corporate fuckery. 这两个人的名字叫什么？哦，雨夏、林真。You and Lin, okay. I also can't help but notice that. In the second episode, after we get the establishment of the time travel and all that stuff, we're getting a uh, an episode that involves going back to a sundered partnership. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it's a fun way to potentially foreshadow some themes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I love how they always seem tired. Because mm -hmm. they end up not maybe caring so much about their own bodies. You know? I mean... Oh, oh, they're literally bringing it up in that most yeah. direct way. But like, if jet lag is bad, imagine what time lag is. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> That's funny. Mm -hmm. That's really funny. Yeah. Like, if he's just also casually seeing. Nice, nice. I love that they need to use pictures as like the focus point to being their insert into the past. Hmm. <laughs> Go in there. Yep. Yeah. Ah, oh, that's good. Food animation. Oh my god. All right. <laughs> wow, you always begin conversations this way? <laughs> I love how he, as her, tried to lift up the box and was really like, fuck! <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> 
。哦，那你呢？我的乐趣就是欣赏你吃面食的幸福表情。他看起来好像也并没那么坏。耶，不要妄下判断，人是会变的。这面的汤头是加了什么呀？一股扑鼻的清香，入口又特别干净。我真可以呀，这味道。呀，再可惜哟。谁稀罕？嗯，来。So I wonder if he just has the sight then. Maybe. Oh my god. 随便加戏。哈哈。这哪是我能控制得住的？准备换下一张吧。你们的女寝那一晚一夜爆红，请问你有何感想？呃，其实也没太多想法。怦然本来就是我个人。Yes, I have to go through the photos and、uh -huh. <laughs> skipping through the years. 停停停停停！<laughs> 你要拍照麻烦也别打闪光灯行不行？<laughs> 会影响摄像效果的。哎，不好意思啊，你们继续，你们继续。<laughs> 你就趁着记者拍摄他煮面的过程。<laughs> 你有多久没回老家了？嗯，好多年了吧，我也记不清了。生意太忙，回不去了。Dang! Oh. 就这些了吗？嗯，确认无。We might be getting clues more to、yeah. the actual reasons why they they sundered basically、uh -huh. in that room. Right. <coughs> Rather than the recipe. 出现的东西都是市场上能买到的。Is this? But it's not going to be something cheesy like the secret ingredient is love, you know. 别吓！新浪头的设计方案，你挑吧。It was so long ago. Right, you know, she doesn't necessarily remember all these kinds of little things that happened when they were younger. There's a part of me that wonders, though, if you can get a situation where. Oh, those look just wow. Those look real. Those look real. But like, oh, now they're older. Okay, gotcha. Right, but if maybe she had a suspicion about the and like was always wanting to know the recipe, and then as a result of that, it made the other like not feel like she could trust her. Yeah. <laughs> right, because yeah, you only ate in the past. Yeah, that's not your body. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> At least give me something different. Right. So one of the mechanics was just kind of explained there, right? That Based on the things that they do in the past, they can look at the photos to see if anything changed. Oh, we're going into her. Okay. Oh. Nice. Oh, the problem is that in 12 hours, there are no valuable objects. Here, there is an automated cleaning system, and it shows the quality of the food at night. For me, I'm a person who can cook with a fire. It's a good thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah, different ideals for how they run a business. Yeah. Well, but also realistically, she can only cook in one place. Yeah. It's also curious if they could jump into her, could they theoretically just get the recipe? Maybe, but they might not be able to control what memories and it's more feeling based, you know? Yeah, like what, yeah, right. Uh huh. 把女寝那一晚的秘方留下。啊，我也不知道。若之，按台词说。无可奉告。这是我们的共有财产，谁都没资格占为己有。我可以找律师告你。自辩。没想到彻底改变的那个人，是他。Yeah。事实无绝对，赶紧走吧。让一下。Maybe there really isn't anything special with the recipe. Yeah. Like, and that's why... She's just desperate to... Right, but that's also why they can't get anything from her, right? Right, yeah. Because it really is just... Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna start over without you. Wow. Okay. Fuck. Someone wanted to keep the passion for the actual mm -hmm. cooking and seeing people do this, and she just wanted to make money and grow. Right. Oh. 之后还有机会吗？没了。他在家哭了一整晚，哦，都没去。Damn. Because the friendship is lost.、Yeah. Right. Oh. 
And this is another example of where he wants mm-hmm. to try and get things back to help them without... Yeah. But he can't change anything, you know? Little ticket stubs? I guess. <笑>当地人会把他们晒干磨成粉当做调味料使用哦就是说林真经常去香抓是因为姓霍 应该是香花草粉。当然了，这也只是我们根据线索的推断。试试可能还需要您派人调制。平倩，不会错了，不会错，就是他。Yeah, yeah. Wow, so this might have actually been the thing for her to. Maybe she'll let it go. Like, maybe we'll see. They had a picture they missed. Wow. <gasps> oh, come on. And just like that. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Oh. Damn it. That little bit of pettiness of like. <laughs> I wasn't behind you going back there, so I'm not gonna help you. Oh, yeah. Because it's from a her hometown. Wow. Oh. And this is how it happened for the first time. Yeah. And it always seemed sweeter back then. Uh huh. Yep. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Oh, that's beautiful. Now she realizes like how much she fucked mm. up that she's like right. she thought she had, you know, stopped yeah. caring about you. No, she never forgot. She, yeah. Well, not only never forgot, it was never some secret ingredient. No. She was just making noodles for you. Yeah, yeah. It was always for you. Right? Like Yeah. And going back to the beginning, and that's also how you can know exi- you'll be able to find where she went. Right. 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 You know? <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is so pretty. Mm. Yeah, and let's get the time lapse of her. Uh huh. Growing older as she's going back. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Yeah. And then transition into the. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Oh. There we go. Ninja. And now she'll turn and be older. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm gonna cry. This is. Oh, this is so beautiful. All right, all right. All right. Mm-hmm. Ah. <sighs> Didn't know she put onions in the soup. I know. <laughs> Fuck, man. All right. Hey,俗话说，书读百遍，其义自现。来尝尝我这复刻版的南秦男。啊，我没有读过。你要是敢把照相馆改成面馆。<laughs> <laughs> I leave right now. <laughs> You'll have to share. Just like back yeah. then. Yeah. yeah. Uh, 
<laughs> it's like as the as the ticking was happening, I'm just waiting for it to be like a mad dash, you know? <laughs> yeah, just. <laughs> Well, and then the question is, is what happens if they both go for the same noodle? Also, we got confirmation that they have a Photoshop, mm -hmm. and it's that he's just, he's just living in one of the rooms there, right. paying rent, you know? Okay, we got ourselves a proper little episodic mini-story mm -hmm. yep. episode to and give nobody us... nobody died. Nobody died, everything was wonderful, everything mm -hmm. was sweet, Yep. and yes, things kind of worked changed but not really because it's the decisions of the character bringing mm -hmm. in the issue being like yep oh now i now that i know what's going on i can i can do something about this yeah and that's what's so powerful it, it reminds me of taking a lot of those stories that very much have that friendship partnership sundered but we'll still kind of look back on those times fondly very fox and the hound kind yep, of i was just instead, about to say fox but and instead the of hound. having it be that they kind of look back on it fondly it's the no we'll come back Mm -hmm. Set aside our stuff. Yep. And yep. That's and, I mean, and reach yeah. each other. And that's it's <laughs> beautiful. It's beautiful. It's Ugh. it's something where, like, um, the idea that you know, like I mentioned, you know, oh, I kind of hope it's not something as simple as you know, oh, the secret ingredient is love or whatever, you know. But yeah, no, mechanically, that, yeah, kind of was, that, yeah, right, exactly. It, it there was, was a secret a, ingredient. There, literally, there, there but, was a literal secret ingredient. Yeah. But you know, that's what it was. And the thing is, is that like, hey. You know, if it ain't broke, don't fix it, right? Mm -hmm. Both from the standpoint of the, the soup, but then also like, yeah, stories like this, it works. It, it works. works. There's a reason people keep doing it, you know? Mm -hmm. And it's just like, I made this for you! Yeah. Like, hey, that's, right. that's actually the thing that a lot of creatives will tell you. Make something that you would enjoy, basically. Mm -hmm. Right, the, the story that you wished you could read or watch, exactly. but it doesn't exist, yeah. Because you are in a in a wonderful sense, you are not that unique. There's a mm. lot of people like you. And the right. idea mm. that because you made something uniquely for one person mm -hmm. means that you're not necessarily going to have that thing that you made be that uh, common. Yeah, It will then speak to a lot of people in a common way, but it itself will feel unique to them. Right. And that's that's such a that's such a special thing when mm. you have food, because food is not just a survival thing. It's an expression of joy for yep. life. It, it, mm -hmm. it is one of the great like sources of happiness that you can find oh, yeah. in oh, yeah. a in a relationship is just the way in which you come together over a meal. And mm -hmm. that's that's so it sweet is. to have this story just be focused on that while we have our main characters be in their, you know, beginnings of their partnership. Oh or yeah. At it, the very least, probably the beginnings general stages, because they might be childhood friends oh, when they were like ten or something. Sure. You know? But in a lot of ways, I'm really glad that they didn't take up too much space in the episode mm, because I like too. the story of the the two characters in the past. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, Chang and Lu Guang didn't need to be in there. No. They didn't. Right? Like you could have you could have totally just had that as the setup that like oh yeah they're doing this thing and then never showed them again right uh -huh. and then and it, it still would have been a fantastic episode right like the and i also love that the uh so <laughs> the secret ingredient being love right mm. but also just the idea of a secret ingredient mm. if you think about it these yeah. two people are running a business together right they get shipments regularly right mm. there would be no actual way to keep it a secret from your business partner who's doing the books, what the ingredient is, mm -hmm. it'd be a lot easier to do what the amount of the ingredient is or how it's prepared or something like that. Yeah. But to actually keep it a secret of what the ingredient is, that's actually very telling that the kind of ingredient is something that they're not buying, mm -hmm. right? That's true. Like they're just, or you know, maybe they are, but they're not they buying it when they're at the when, right when they're at the business, right? Yep. You know, and so it's oh yeah, they go back, they go back home. And they bring back the stuff from back then that, you know, their their parents gave them or they got at the yep. local market, you know, right? Yep. And it's just, yeah, it's there just you ground go. Ground up flowers. Ground up flowers. Ground up flowers and the, the root associated with the flower. Yeah. Yeah. That, that's awesome. Yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. That, makes, yeah. that makes total sense. And it's also just, you know, it's like, it's like liquid nostalgia mm -hmm. in the story. Yes. But then also within the context of the food itself the world. yeah yeah it's also yeah it's, it's also course. nostalgia sprinkled over this to right like, right exactly hey do you remember the time when when we were young and we had dreams and mm -hmm. you encouraged me to uh 
take basically this little bit of your home and mm -hmm. your heart and put it into my cooking. And then the way that you looked when we combined our our aspects together and we made something together, like Yeah. I also like that's 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 also the longing of the 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 one girl who, you know, had the secret ingredient here mm -hmm. in this case to be like that's what I've been looking for. That's what I've been mm -hmm longing for and yep. i love that there's those subtle little bits of like mm, they 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 had something they had some oh, kind yeah. of connection it's definitely the like they were together but we're not going to confirm it you mm -hmm. know yeah yeah. Uh -huh. yeah yeah yep yep also uh there's that part of me that that loves the idea that um maybe the reason that she was being like secretive with like the film crew and things like that mm. Uh, apart from the fact that maybe the relationship wasn't going too good by that point, and it was, you know, this level of a production and, and whatnot. Wait, at the, what point? Uh, when when the film crew is coming in to be like, oh, you know. When they're younger? No, 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 not when they're younger. No, no, when, uh, I mean, maybe. Because uh, there's two points when the relative. film crew come in. When they're actually, like, vi like recording her making the 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 soup, right? Oh. And then, and then she's like, you don't get to see any more of the process, right? Right, because that point, that point, I was just gonna say, there's the point here where they're older, where she's uh -huh. trying all the soups. That's the point where they're older. But actually, at the point where they're getting the TV Doing crew the... come in, that's when they're younger. So oh, their they're... relationship is pretty, pretty good then, as far as things go. Okay, well, there's there's something like both from the standpoint of the secret ingredient being an actual secret ingredient that yes, you want to keep, you know, right. you don't want to let people know about. Mm -hmm. But two, if the secret ingredient isn't like that crazy special mm -hmm. you know it's the yeah no uh from a business angle don't let people know like don't let people actually see the making of it because then they might be like wait that's that's just regular soup right mm -hmm. like you know that what what actually is special about it right you know uh, i love but, the i love the point where they're trying the new uh flavor lines and product lines and stuff mm -hmm. to basically show that the passion and dream of this girl to make food for her her friend here is being diluted by the focus on no we need to expand all this other stuff here we need to yeah uh we need to diversify we need to do all this other stuff here she's mm -hmm. not actually uh she's not actually like focused on oh yeah she wasn't creating. even enjoying the the the, the product no, she's just shoving it she's in like there. she's like it's it's down to the mechanical elements of I need to ascertain the quality of this. Yeah. You know. Yeah. And then meanwhile we're having also our our, our boy here. Um I've just realized he has literally the Aaron man bun and the Shimpe man bun. Too. Uh -huh. It's becoming yeah. more and more of a thing. But uh Cheng is getting sick of noodles while he's going oh, through all this thing as while well. While he's inhabiting her Yeah experiences the, of it the idea nice. that she's losing her passion and her taste and her enjoyment of the yeah, thing yeah. that used to uh -huh. be the thing that they would bond over right I feel like it's such a cool way in which the feelings back then in the when he's inhabiting the body can still affect him in the present well it can still affect him in the present but it's also something where in the same way that the uh the 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 books lady yeah wasn't able to understand exactly what was going on or didn't see put much import in it yeah right because um, different priorities and different focuses and things like that. Right. Um, Which is Chang, why it's so cool that when they switched who they were inhabiting, we got to see that different right, perspective. Right, exactly. And and uh, Cheng then also has this kind of, you know, uh, visceral response <laughs> when at the beginning he's like, no, dude, this is this is the best shit ever. This is so good. And, and the fact <laughs> Bro, that... Bro, you're missing out, the man. The fact that you're not having any of it... Hmm. Mm, 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 mm. I also Peace. just I also really love I mentioned it in the the reaction, but the idea that um Lu Guang definitely can see what he's seeing. Mm -hmm. Like that is definitely something that he's getting there. Right, but he doesn't actually but get But he doesn't the emotions, get any right? of the emotions, he doesn't get the taste, he mm -hmm. doesn't get any yep. of the bodily fulfillment of eating the food. Meaning right. that what he's effectively doing is the eyes thing is basically the that's the part that he's getting mm -hmm. here. That's that's yep. it. For well <laughs> To contrast with the previous episode, mm -hmm. for financial reports, that's perfect. Yes, because it's numbers and data. Yep. There is nothing. Click, 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 there click, is click, nothing click. qualitative. It is all quantifiable very easily. Yeah, uh, with something like the taste of a home cooked meal by someone from someone who loves you. Yeah, yeah, you can't exactly. You can't exactly. You can't exactly that. pick up on that. Yeah. You know, 
and yeah, so great. This, this was wonderful. I feel like this was also a uh, and the classic a, taxi driver gives away the info, but just right, nonchalantly, right. Just yeah, like, oh, you know, yeah, that's that's the that's the thing right there. And he's yeah. like, oh, wait, oh shit, yeah, yeah. But like the the tonal just breath of fresh air too, mm. given how mm. like you know d- dreary the previous episode one was. Of like, I mean, also very heartfelt, but, but oh, very yes. heartfelt. But it's like, but yes, it ended on a dour but, note. For God sure. damn, you know, yes. it's like, oh, yes, there's gonna be this reunion between the fan. Oh no, she's fucking she's dead. Fucking bra, bra, dead. Yep. So, all right, there we are. Mm-hmm. Um, a really good episode that might mean a lot thematically in the long term, oh, but yes. in the short term, it's another example of showing that this is their job. They do mm-hmm. this regularly, and also. They have a pretty strong bond and relationship, but every bond can be tested. Mm-hmm. Every relationship can have yep. something small. Right. That got while the... he looked at the, the 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 news report again, he's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, and specifically thinking about that when he's like, should we break up? You know. And then it's like that. Well, you did kind of screw up last time. You know. Well, well, that's 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 not what he was saying. Should we? He was basically saying, what would we ever break? Oh, up? Oh yeah, would we ever break up? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Why? Basically, like, how could people do that? Like, why? Wh- you know, right. what, for what reason then, could we ever break up? And then know? Lu Guang immediately thinks of a potential reason. Yeah. You yeah. know. Yeah. Yeah. Right. But we don't know if that's him thinking about if Chang ends up finding out that that's what his actions led to. Sure. Or if it's the. Yeah. Oh no! I saw you. You were not oh, right. following the rules. No, because as, as that... Chang's essentially his handler, right? You've got the. I need to make sure that he. Um... Wait, he's Chang's handler. Yeah, Lu Guang. Oh, oh, gotcha, yeah. gotcha. Right, right, right. I'm yeah. Con- yeah, um, yeah, because yeah. so you know he he's got to make sure that Chang actually does the right things when he's in the past, mm-hmm. but he's also the one that needs to make sure that Chang is. Like, uh-huh. not just chooses to do the right things, but mm-hmm. is able to do the right things, yeah. you know, and that the job doesn't get too heavy for him or whatever. He doesn't get like, oh, fuck, I, I ended up getting that girl killed. Yeah, I'm not doing this anymore, you know, right? right. right? Like, that that theoretically could happen. But. Yeah, I am also very interested to figure out why they're not just a Photoshop. What's the reason why they're doing this beyond just wanting to help people? I feel like this, yeah, like, if we, I feel like uh, if that's going to be gotten into in the show, I feel like we'll probably get a better idea of that, a better picture of that uh-huh. in the next episode. If not, they mm-hmm. could totally go for the thing of the just, this is part of the premise that they've got this cool thing that they can do, and it's through a Photoshop, and yeah, people come to them with photos to try and get help with things because apparently these guys are great at just discerning clues from photos. We don't know how they do it. You know? I and mean, then hey, it's, th- there's weird jobs out there, you know? Like, yeah. Everyone yeah. has their, their thing and be like, advertising, we are investigators, and we will help figure out, you know... Things that well, other people wouldn't be able to know. You and know? people pay psychics. So like, That's you true. Know, yes, well said. Like, people will pay money for the dumbest shit. Mm-hmm. So the idea that people are paying money for these like special Holmes and Watson kind of style investigators, yeah. you know. Well, and especially totally given that so plausible. far they've been, do- they, they've been doing it in sort of like high paying situations. Mm-hmm. Uh, Rich people, they don't care about how you do something if they're just like, yeah, uh, when I Wave put money and solve when, the problem. When I put the money into this thing, it actually gives me something that I wouldn't get anywhere else. Cool. You cool. know, right? Ye. Like whether you're psychics or, you know, whatever. Uh, we don't care. We, we don't give a fuck. Does right. Con- bring any consequences to us? No. OK, cool. Then here yeah, you go. Just Here's do money. It. Yeah. Solve look it. at these photos. Sure. You know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But all right. Y'all, thank you so much for watching this episode's reaction and discussion. If you want to see the next episode's reaction and discussion right now, though, go check out the link in the description below for our Patreon. You get an early access there. You watch full-length timer reactions there, and all this comes with Discord access, so you can chat with us in the community there about the show, about anime in general, and also be sure to check out my Baldur's Gate 3 Let's Play on Twitch. If any of that interests you, we'll see you there. But until then, we're Semblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we'll see you all next time. time.